Well, today is Valentine's Day and of course the flower shop. Well, it's love day and the owner of Creatures Flores says that flower arrangements are flying off the shelves, but other people in the low country aren't feeling the love this Valentine's Day. At Creatures Flores, the phone is ringing off the hook today. All right, I can help you out with that. Hundreds of flower arrangements being made for lovers in the low country. We'll have 10 trucks out on the road delivering. We've got about 250 deliveries going out today. Raleigh Beasley, the owner of Creatures, says even with inflation, people are paying about the same as last year for an arrangement. We've seen flower prices taper off a little bit where we saw the past few years they were going up. But as the love is blooming at Creeches, just down the road at Freehouse Brewery, some are celebrating a little differently. If they're just some old clothes or some stuff that just reminds you of your ex, come on down, we'll throw it, we'll throw it in the back of the truck and you don't have to look at it anymore around your apartment. Paul Hayes, the owner of Junk King in Charleston, is allowing people to come by and throw away any old memories from an ex. Hayes says it's a perfect way to start over. Why not on Valentine's Day if there's something holding you back relationship-wise? Just uh, get rid of it and uh, and move on. Hayes says for every item dumped today, he's donating $1 to the American Heart Association. So someone's heartbreak isn't going completely to waste. In North Charleston, Sophia Radebaugh, Count on Two.